who is going to be the next president of USA. I am sure you all are curious and would like to know that. Hello friends, I am astrologer and Vastu consultant Ridhi Behel. November 2020, USA will be having its election for the next president. Who is going to be the next president of USA? I am sure you all are curious and would like to know that. For that, I did a little research where I studied the horoscope of America, studied the planetary position of that time, uh, what we call as transit. Also studied the horoscope of uh, Mr. Donald Trump and Mr. Joe Biden. So let's analyze the horoscope of Mr. Donald Trump. Donald Trump has some very strong combinations, yoga and Raj Yoga as we say. These are powerful combinations which are making his horoscope extremely strong horoscope. And that is the reason why he is the president of America. But then what next? What does the future hold for him? So let's analyze the horoscope. His is a Leo Lagna with Lagna Lord in the 10th house. Here, Lagna Lord, here, Sun being the Lagna Lord in the 10th house gets directional strength. So, Sun here is very strong. Apart from that, Sun it represents government, government authorities, and anything related or linked with the government. 10th house is also the house of your karmas and your profession. So, Lagna Lord going to 10th, getting a directional strength is a very powerful yoga. Mars, which is the fourth, fourth Lord and the Ninth Lord, is placed in the Lagna in a friendly sign. Ninth house is the house for luck, your fortune. So, Ninth Lord going to Lagna is making a person, will, is making him a fortunate person, a lucky man. Fourth house, fourth house represents masses, people. In a politician's chart, fourth house represents power, authority. So, fourth lot has gone to Lagna. From there, it is aspecting its own house, which is the fourth house. And it is aspecting the seventh house. Seventh house is the house for public image. Also, it is the house for holding a post. What post you hold in life? The post can be a post of a manager in a company, can be a post of a CEO or a post of a president of a country. So see, such a strong and powerful combination and connection of the Kendras and the Kendra Lords. And that is what is making this horoscope an extraordinarily powerful horoscope. Dasha. Dasha plays a very important role because you need to get the right Dasha at the right time to get the desired results. So when the elections will be there, the Dasha Mr. Trump will be undergoing will be of Jupiter, uh, Saturn and Mars. Jupiter is his fifth lord and eighth lord placed in the second house. From there it is aspecting sixth house. Saturn which is the lord of uh, sixth house and seventh house is placed in the twelfth house and is aspecting the sixth house. Also the transiting Saturn is transiting in the sixth house. Therefore his sixth house is very activated and very strong Dasha wise and also transit wise. Now why so much of importance to the 6th house? Because 6th house is the house for competition. And as I said, it is a competition, you know, contesting an election is a competition. So his house of competition is favoring him. Then the Antar Dasha Nath, Nath Lord is Saturn. Saturn, as I said, 6th Lord sitting in the 6th house, aspecting, sixth, uh, aspecting its own house is also being favorable. Now comes Mars, which is the Pratyantar Dasha Nath, Nath Lord and which is playing a very important and crucial role. Mars is placed at the time of elections, it will be placed in Piscean sign, that is his 8th house and it will be retrograde. Now when a planet is retrograde, we can see the results from the previous house. Now the previous house to the 8th house is the 7th house. And as I said, 7th house is the house of, you know, post and house of public image. So he, his chances of getting the highest post, that is a president of a country, will be fulfilled. Also, Mars is aspecting 11th house, which is the house of gains. So it will be a gainful position for him. Also, in Trump's horoscope, the 8th Lord uh, Jupiter and the 6th uh, Lord Saturn, that is the 8th Lord and 
the uh, sixth lord are forming a bandhan yog to the lagn that is on one side is jupiter to the lagn and the other side is saturn to the lagn uh, to the lagn uh well if there is such a such a strong combination of lagna with sixth lord and eighth lord it indicates such a person will not accept uh, a defeat easily he will do anything and will go to any extent to ensure his victory so friends so my conclusion to the whole discussion is that that mr trump will be the next president of usa this is my little analysis i would love to have a feedback from all of you thank you so much